At Arkansas Baptist College, there is a spirit of excellence that extends far beyond the borders of the campus. In the spring of 2009, Arkansas Baptist College President, Dr. Fitzhill, joined a group of Arkansas church pastors and business leaders on a trip to Africa. And as I looked at the, the people, and they looked at me, and there was almost a connection, you know, that, that I really felt because they wanted to know more about me, uh, and then I wanted to know more about them. For two Rwandans, that trip became a life-changing experience. It provided them the opportunity to pursue their dream of coming to America, where they could earn a college degree. I grew up as an orphan, so I know what it means to become an orphan, and I know how in need orphans are. So I'm blessed to be in the U.S. studying in Arkansas Baptist College. I'm going to give it back to those kids that I started the work, I have to again complete it, but I will not complete it alone. Support from people will help me complete the work. So it's a blessing that when people come, uh, we are blessed. Like myself, I was blessed because people like Dr. Hill and Scott Ford came in Rwanda, not because they wanted to come in Rwanda, because they wanted to come and experience what these people went through. <laughs> After visiting many villages and coffee plantations, Dr. Hill was deeply moved by the Rwandan people. I was touched, my heart was touched. I was moved to, to see how people who had very little were, were giving so much. And then I thought back about the United States. We have so much and appear to be giving so little. And I said, how can we connect the two so we can learn from them and maybe give some of the blessings that God has given us back here, back over there, so they can do better. Dr. Hill had a vision for Arkansas Baptist College to partner with Rwanda Trading Company, founded by Little Rock's own Scott Ford and other influential business owners, to form the African Bean Company. So as I sit down and, and, and started thinking about this vision on how we could be a blessing locally and globally, the coffee just kept coming up. I think it's a very good project and they're really doing good because it is not only benefiting the Rwandese people, but it is also going to benefit the school because it will attract many population to come and test the coffee from Rwanda. The African Bean Company brand is named Roots Java and its business operation allows Arkansas Baptist College students to receive hands-on training and the ability to develop valuable skills in entrepreneurship and general business. This is a story of bringing people together, you know, joining the U.S. and the people around to Rwanda because you'll be able to have a test of their coffee and they'll be able to have the test of your income. Harvested from the rolling hills of Africa, Roots Java symbolizes the reconnection to African roots, the revitalization of a people, a country, and our communities. It is a symbol of hope for a better tomorrow. I got this blessing from God. He opened my mind and I started to see my vision in a different way and to think differently. And he opened this door for me to be uh, now in the United States of America and I didn't have any college education. It's a big miracle not only to me, also to the people who knows me well back home. This coffee, hopefully, the money, the profits that will be out of it, it will go back and help those kids go to school and even go on a higher education. The sale of each bag of Roots Java will not only help restore the neighborhoods surrounding historically black colleges in the United States, it will also help farming communities in Africa to regain the hope and independence they deserve. We want to take proceeds from this coffee and help develop urban communities. We want to take proceeds from this coffee and help develop the villages in Rwanda. We want the proceeds to go and empower and engage and educate, liberate, give hope, love, and, and just be an inspiration. The positive impact of Roots Java will not only be felt right here at home, but also across the world. That's what Roots Java is about, 
It's about giving back and be a blessing locally and globally. Wherever, however, that's what we plan to do.